Right here behind me that that wrong way crash happened in the eastbound lanes of the Loop 202 freeway just before 40th Street. I'm going to step away for a minute and you can see crews are still here working to clear out all the debris and burned up metal. One lane of traffic has been reopened and the other lanes should be open in about an hour, which would be great news for folks heading home from work. Now, a passerby took this video shortly after the deadly collision. Some pretty intense flames. A DPS official tells us it was sometime around 1030 this morning. Someone in a mid-sized SUV was driving the wrong way along the Loop 202 freeway in Ahwatukee when that vehicle sideswiped a minivan, then crashed head-on into an 18-wheeler that burst into flames. The wrong way driver died at the scene, but the driver of the big rig was not hurt. It's too soon to say whether alcohol was a factor. Most of these wrong way crashes usually happen late at night or early in the morning. Certainly our investigation wants to determine why. Uh, where was this uh, driver over the past 24 to 48 hours? Where did the vehicle enter? So the, these are questions that the investigation is working to determine. Uh, sadly, certainly we've seen that some of these are intentional. Typically, we see impairment, though, with wrong-way drivers. Now, traffic was backed up for miles along the 202 freeway heading eastbound towards I-10. We're told another big rig was involved when it drove through some of the crash debris, but nobody else was hurt. The name of the wrong-way driver has not yet been released. Back out here live, you can see traffic still moving very, very slowly along this stretch of, of the Loop 202 freeway. They're telling me that it should be open all the way in about an hour, and that's what everybody out here is hoping again, hoping to get it all reopened before rush out our traffic. If we get any new details, we'll let you know. Reporting live in Ahwatukee, Jason Berry for Arizona's Family. Yeah,